You know, KT was so uh, was a huge challenge. I mean, we knew that he was going to be a very iconic character, and we thought maybe it's a, a more serious version of C-3PO. John's brief for K2SO was that he he literally wanted a black protocol droid or a you know kind of a black C-3PO. Some of our earliest designs were just simply variations on C-3PO, and they weren't quite hitting the look. Um, so we went back to sort of our safety net, Ralph McQuarrie. We went back to his sketchbooks. And he had drawn many versions of these very elegant robots, um, almost stylized, where they had very thin limbs. We explored many versions of that, using Ralph as a foundation for updating it. And I think the final version is a really unique take on it because it adds something very bold and very fresh. And I think in terms of designing for Star Wars, you need that. You need that boldness, you need that freshness. I've got a bad feeling about it. Hey. Quiet. What? 